Once upon a time, Zhuang Zhou dreamed that he was a butterfly, a butterfly flitting and fluttering about, happily enjoying himself. He did not know that he was Zhuang Zhou. Soon he awaked, and probably was Zhuang Zhou again. He did not know whether he was Zhuang Zhou who had dreamed he was a butterfly. Or whether it was a butterfly, dreaming that it was Zhuang Zhou. Between Zhou and a butterfly, that there must be a distinction. This is called the transformation of things. So we can say Zhuang Zhou. Zhuangzhou and butterfly. Mm. Yeah, there should be distinction. Mm. Yeah. Zhuangzhou is Zhuangzhou, butterfly is butterfly. This is called distinction. If there is no distinction, So, <clears throat> when in the dream, Zhuang Zhou did not know that he was Zhuang Zhou. Mm. Okay, this is the dream. Then forgot about it. he is Zhuang Zhou. When he awakened, awakened. Mm. Awake. Then no, oh, I made a, a dream. It is false, not something true. Not something true. So he did not know whether he was strong though who had dreamed he was a butterfly. <coughs> Between Zhuangzhou, Zhuangzhou is Zhuangzhou, butterfly is butterfly, there is a distinction. But when I dream, yeah, when Zhuangzhou is dreaming, yeah, he did not know whether he was Zhuangzhou who had dreamed he was a butterfly. Or whether it was a butterfly dreaming that it was Zhuangzhou. Yeah. Dreamed he was a butterfly, flitting and fluttering about happily, enjoying himself. In the dream. So he did not know that he was Zhuang Zhou. When in the dream, he did not know he was Zhuang Zhou. Yeah. But when he awakened, he knew how oh, I am Zhuang I am Zhuang Zhou, and I make a dream of butterfly. Mm -hmm. So when he was in the state of... Uh, Dream. When he was in the state of dreaming, um, it, 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 um, and he was deep in his consciousness, he could be, he could be anything. Mm. But and then when he came back into himself again, he was in the physical. Mm. So then, from the physical perspective, he couldn't tell whether he was. Mm. Zhuang who had dreamed he was the butterfly. Mm. Yeah. So he was going in and out of a different state of consciousness. Hmm, makes sense. So it is a different state of the consciousness.
different state of consciousness. Correct? Yes. Dream is one state of consciousness. <coughs> Awakened is another one. Hmm? Correct? But how do I explain the distinction between John Zhou and Butterfly? Hmm? Why in the dream, John Zhou changed into Butterfly? But when he awaked, hmm? there is a distinction. Because you can be anything? In the dream, he can be anything. Then awakened, awake. Because you go back to your physicalness, no? It's where the focus, I mean, it's a different state of consciousness, and then when you're awake, you put your, again, your focus is here, mm -hmm. but you could also have your awareness mm -hmm. in, in both realms, in the Changchu and the butterfly mm -hmm. uh, realm. What if in the realm? Yeah. So in the dream, John Zhou wandering through the different realm? No, it's the same consciousness. The same consciousness, yeah. but it forms different realm. Yeah. But how do you explain? In the dream, then, it seems that there is no distinction. But when you are wicked, hmm? then this thing is again. Because it's matter. When, yeah. it's, when, it's, when, it's ma when he's awake, he's... he's um, the limits of the material world. He's within the boundaries of the material world. When he awakens. But uh, even in the dream, we talk uh, we term it as a different state of the consciousness. Yeah, but he's not there. It means he moves that, beyond the material. Oh, you mean in a dream, there's no limitation of materiality? Well, not really. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It depends on how you define dream. Yeah. Maybe another way to look at it is that the concept between Chuang Tzu and butterflies is that the, the observer, the awareness, is there and, and, uh, and it's still yeah. like I'm I'm me, but in, in when he's strong as you, I'm me as strong as you. When he's the butterfly, I'm me. But the I, I mean, I'm, I'm I don't want to put words on it really, like say I, but it's the awareness mm. is still there and it's still experiencing that it's whatever it is. Mm -hmm. So that's that doesn't change. It's like constant almost, even even though. So there's like no break actually, and, and I mean, although you black out, but maybe that's a, just another version of like the butterfly or strong as you when you black out. That's the, but. See what I'm saying? Mm. Does that make sense? The, the awareness is still there. It's almost like it doesn't change at all. It's, it stays constant, almost. I guess so it's almost the more, we think of strong Jew is the most stable because we keep coming back to him. The butterfly was only a moment and you know you gotta you know, pay the bill tomorrow or the rent. But that, maybe that's not the most constant. The most constant is the awareness because that actually, between strong Jew and butterfly, it doesn't change, you're still experiencing you're still aware, you just all of a sudden you're Chuangzu, and then all of a sudden you're, that's the mystery. All of a sudden you're the butterfly, all of a sudden you're Chuangzu. What happened? And you just take it for granted and you bought into the whole thing, you know, basically, when you're, when you're, uh, I think when, when he's dreaming, his awareness is of everything, yeah. the one thing. And when he wakes up, he now focuses his awareness, so it becomes the object. He, yeah. he, he lost his focus of everything of all. So, so, you mean in the dream it is uh, awareness? Yeah, awareness. Mm -hmm. Then, awake uh, it is also awareness. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it is different sleep. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Right. Different rules. <laughs> yeah, different rules. Hmm? But you know, hmm? 
it depends on how you define dream, because there is lucid dreaming when in that dream it is just as real as this is. So, and it's all the same consciousness, and the consciousness just wanders hmm. around, and sometimes it's it's more concrete, and sometimes it's less concrete. Mm. Mm. Also, you, you talk about uh, it's different state of awareness. Mm. Yeah, we have to yeah understand it is different state of awareness. You say this is the loose, loose one. There's uh, no yeah, concrete, yeah, compact. Mm -hmm. mm. And then this one, yeah, part purple, part purple. So this is a different state, mm -hmm. different state. But we know awareness, exercise, its influence throughout the, yeah. The realm, the whole realm, it will mean dream, awake. Mm. But uh, we want to know the. This story looks yeah, very interesting. Yeah. What is the hidden meaning? What kind of the meaning you want to. Yeah. Express to people. You want to know the exact meaning? Yeah. You want to tell something? You want to know well, that tell. we make up our world, you mm. know, that uh, the world is what you think it is. Mm. We decide, we are the creators of our, of our... We are creative. We are creators. Creators. Of, yeah, we create our world oh. through our consciousness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it means, yeah, when there is a consciousness, then there is an object yeah, corresponding to it. Opposite to it. Yeah, opposite to it. But uh, something more? This is dream. Okay, one state of the awareness. Perhaps you will use this is loose yeah, awareness. Yeah. Then awake it. Awake. Then I know it is dream. Okay, some metaphor. Mm. <laughs> ah, this is a... Uh, what? Vaz. Vaz, yeah. Inside there are some earth inside. Then there is a seed. When spring comes, Hmm? Be a leaf. Then the leaf. Oh, previously I'm in the in the earth, in the woods. But when I'm in the woods, I don't know I'm in the woods. But when I'm out of the woods, I know oh, previously I'm in the woods <laughs> and in the earth also. But previously, I think, oh, this is the whole world. Mm -hmm. Then no concept of the was or earth or water. Then, mm -hmm, look back. Oh. Previously, I'm in the was. So could you say that's the same thing as the finger? Finger. Mm -hmm. finger. <laughs> or the leaf, the leaf on the twig. Connected mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. to the, 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 the trunk and, and, and the trunk. And also, we should understand the same with people. People are in the, in the realm where desire prevails. Thoughts or awareness prevail. 
parasite don't know. Yeah? People are in the realm where their desire, thoughts, thinking, or awareness persist or prevail. But they don't know. So probably, oh, this is dream, this is awakening. So this is Zhongzi, Zhongzhou, awareness. This is butterfly, also awareness. Yeah, also awareness. Yeah. If there is no awareness, hmm? Zhongzhou and the butterfly, Dream. Hmm. Opposite to dream, it is awake. Hmm. It is awake. Hmm. But both awake and dream are, are indicate the realm where the awareness dominate mm -hmm. and prevail. And prevail. But this, this is a different state of the consciousness. A different state of consciousness. Please understand that only when there comes the awaked thing, there is a elimination of the dream. Correct? Mm -hmm. If you are continue to be in the dream, <coughs> you will never awake. Correct? So when we talk about the uh, awareness, it will have both dream and awake in code. But please understand the opposition between dream and awake. Only there come the awake, the dream can be eliminated. Yeah, it is the fourth one. Okay, then... Hmm? Both dream and awake, they mean the sphere where awareness prevails. So both the dream and the awake is a dream. Hmm? Then if hmm, there comes another another understanding, hmm, then both the dream and the awake can be eliminated. How to term it? Big awakening. Big awakening. Yeah. So relatively speaking, oh, this when it is awake, then this one eliminated. Hmm? Eliminated. It is false. This is real. But please understand the awareness still prevail. It is different state. You think, oh, this is something real. This is true. Please understand, we are depending upon the awareness. Yeah. So it is <coughs> relatively, relatively speaking, we are still in the delusion. Yeah. Delusion. Then, there comes the big awakening. Then both the dream and the awakening. Yeah. Hmm? Eliminate it. Then, Big awakening, how to describe it? Independence. Because there's nothing we depend upon. Hmm? Both dream and uh, awake, we depend, we depend upon awareness. 
no awareness where comes the dream and the awakening. But when there comes a big awakening, there's no dependent, no opposite, no opposite, no inside, no outside. Then this is a big awakening. Where it is? No place. No place. So, but from the top, this is called, called um, transformation of sense. If there comes the distinction, then there comes the transformation of sense. Why? Because the awareness continues <coughs> to persist, to prevail. Then you can say it is a continual update of changes. Some idea? Yeah. So this is the meaning. Yeah. Don't want to tell you. Different layer. Dream. Then awakened. I know. Or dream is false. Then, if you think this is the real, no. Still, it is a yeah, place where awareness yeah, prevail. Then, yeah. There comes a big awakening. But even we use the term big awakening, we should know really there is no awakening. <laughs> no, nothing. Really nothing. We, we, have, we, we have no words to describe it. But we know it is a place, it is a, a state. Just say that the mind? 